Um, just here again to just point out some more misinformation. So I found this one again on Twitter. You know, if you're not following me, follow me on Twitter. Same name there. Perfect for finding out information. Got to get this all out in the world, you know. Got to just show people what's going on. Because not everyone is following the case. We need to keep that in mind. I know there's like 40,000 plus people watching it whenever it is live. But not everyone is watching it. But anyway, so this is what Amber said in court over here. And then this is from an article that she did. Um, we've talked about it on this TikTok before, like my channel profile. I don't know what you call it on here. Correct me, you know, still a bit new. But um, as you can see, she said, I wasn't a fan of his work. That's Johnny's work. Um, she looked at the jury when she said it. Um, I'm not going to go into too much detail on that one just yet because I really want to talk about what's actually in this article here. <laughs> so, Johnny was Amber's first love, even though she'd never met him, a pal of the 28-year-old beauty told the Inquirer. When she was a teenager, Amber had already decided to become an actress and she had pictures of Johnny all over her room. So it's no surprise they fell in love while working together. Amber can usually get whatever she sets her mind to. So, there's going to be two things, right? So, there's a chance that what was put in this article down here was actually a lie and it was just a way of her, I don't know, seeming more in love with Johnny, potentially. But I don't think it was a lie, because there is an audio recording of Johnny calling out Amber, saying, who were the pictures on your wall when you were younger? And I don't think she responded to it. But I think that might be because she knows, you know, she knows. That's why she didn't say, she doesn't have to say, because Johnny probably already knows anyway. But then the other thing could be, is that <laughs> it's just the truth, literally. Like, there's no other way to put it apart from that. Um, but either way, Amber shouldn't be saying this over here if she has already said this in the past. Because whether she meant what she said in that article it makes her look like a liar thankfully though well I don't know if it's thankful or not the jury aren't allowed to go on the internet or look at social media during this case so they actually wouldn't be aware that she is lying about this so it is very misleading if this is what she has said well if she has she did say it um I think she needs to think more about what she's saying in court and realize that it is being live streamed and that there are loads of people watching it uh, feel free to pause it if you want to take a look. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to share this information here because it's just getting silly.